I'm Ewan. And I'm Ryan. We are the Sheepdogs. And you're watching Guilty Pleasures. Live in Limbo. Food guilty pleasure, probably like nachos, just because like trying not to eat cheese, but uh, god damn it, it's so tasty. <laughs> I would say I'm a pretty big sucker for uh, for burgers. I have to find myself eating a lot of burgers when we're out and about. You're, you're a real burger king. Yeah, a hamburglar of sorts. Let's just say we're pretty good at prank prank phoning, calling people, and pretending to be yeah. other people trying to. I don't go into it, but because uh, I could go to court for some of this stuff. But like, we, one, we time, some good one time on things. on Boxing Day. I, I made a prank call that lasted for 45 minutes, and we taped the whole thing. It was, it was ridiculous. Yeah, yeah I've never really yeah, seen it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Along my sex tape and yeah. all that other stuff. I don't, I don't really believe in feeling guilty about liking any music, because if you just, if you like it, you like it. And uh, I think listening to music because like it's cool or like someone told you to is like a, a cop out. Like just listen to whatever you want to listen to. I'm a pretty big sucker for reality TV. If I'm like in a hotel room. Uh, you know, I've I've been known to watch some pretty bad reality TV, but I mean, I don't know. I just I think it's just so funny. It's just such a weird snapshot of kind of some of the shittiest parts of what our society has become. But you can't really like once it's like a car crash, you can't like stop look at it, even though you probably should. <laughs> uh, I've been known to enjoy the films of Hugh Grant. <laughs> I don't know any of those ones where he's. Super charming. charming. <laughs> yeah, he's a charming guy. Uh, oh. oh, when you spend a lot of time with a whole bunch of people, you learn everybody's bad habits. Yeah, there's a certain guy who I won't mention any names, but he's always playing with drumsticks on his lap, <laughs> all the, annoying everybody. 